Oh, first of all, I want to thank everybody who applied to our $40,000 grant <laughs> that ended last night at midnight. See, every uh, fourth of the month, uh, we close out our $40,000 grant that you could spend on anything. And it's really, we give out uh, $500 or $1,000 uh, for you to spend on anything. Um, and so that's closed, but we'll have a new one up if you, and this is for members only, it's for Let's Go Help members. And they can apply to that and three other grants we have. We have one for uh, car repair, we have one for, um, uh, what do you call it, for, for rent? <laughs> and then we have another one, we, we give 30 uh, free laptops out every month too. So these are monthly and it's a, it could rent up to like $75,000 every month. Uh, we do that. This month's going to be a little low. We're trying to <laughs> recover from our uh, financial problem. We have our credit card processing company. They pulled the rug out from under us. <laughs> it, it, it's a two weeks we got to go. Just terrible how these multi-billion dollar companies just, just can ruin your life in, in seconds. So we're recovering from that and slowly. Uh, so we don't want to spend too much money in this times of changing. So we cut those back from $15,000 to $5,000. But that's just for this month. <laughs> I would think, and we'll keep the others going. So keep in track, we'll always have four grants, <laughs> just no matter how much, because see, that's what we do with our profits. Uh, we give them back uh, to members, uh, and we do it every month. We've been doing it for a year and a half, gave out over a million dollars just to members, and we're a small little company. I mean, we don't make a hell of a lot more of that, uh, but it's profitable, and I can't believe that because we only charge $20, and I never thought I'd be profitable. I just thought we'd have a company that could, at least support me, maybe some other people, and, and help people, as many uh, people that we can possibly help. Uh, and that's all we're trying to do is show people the government programs that are out there. And by the way, if you remember, uh, because of this uh, problem we have with the credit card processing, your, your membership may be a little screwed up. So be patient with us, please. We'll fix anything. We'll refund anything you want. Uh, don't worry about it. We're just here to help people. And if we screw up, you know, uh, administratively, because that's not my strong suit. <laughs> and actually the winds of uh, robots, you know, are against me too. So it's learning that and, and having to uh, help people, but not having to, I wanna help people. And everybody who works here wants to help people as much as we can. Because we see what happens, how people get uh, money uh, just because we gave them a phone number or a website or we're, we're teaching you a process. That's what it's all about. Teaching you a process. Where this help is, it's not in Google. You can't go to Google and find help unless you have money. You know? And the people who really need the help don't have the money. So that's what we're trying to do is get a hold of those people and show them where they could get help without money. They can give money. I'll show you websites that give you money. Now, here's some uh, that I just came across really today. Uh, so like every day, I, I scour the headlines to see what's new because these programs come and go. I mean, they, they're there for a while. They run out of money. They're not there. And, and since COVID happens, it, it, it's not like Social Security and it's there all the time. <laughs> no, it's different than that. You know, the, the elected officials see a problem. Whoa, we better do something with that. We better give more money. That. Okay, they give it money and, they, and it goes to people. And see, they don't know how to advertise on the internet and they're not supposed to. So you have to do some work to find out. And that's what we do. We have unlimited free help to help anybody find all the government grants they're eligible for. And we also have members. Now that's, I think, what's unique about us. It's not only me and my staff that help you personally as much as we can. Now we don't fly out to your house <laughs> and things like that, but it's all online and, and chats and messages and things like that. And we have two websites that do that. When you belong to one, you belong to both. So you could try both. But we also, more importantly, we have members that volunteer to help you for free every day. There's a couple hours, two, three hours of, of members and people, uh, staff that are live, that you can contact live <laughs> online uh, to get the help you need. So don't forget to contact me. And if we mess up your uh, account of it in any way, uh, don't worry, we'll always make it good. Uh, just go to, uh, you gotta contact Magic Mary. She has all the, <laughs> the money stuff. They don't allow me near that. <laughs> I'll screw it up. <laughs> and so she said, find help at gmail.com. Find help at gmail.com. Well, let's go through these uh, 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 new, new uh, rent grants out there. Uh, 
that are not only red crayons, but for anything. And, and that's it. But these are neat and they're unique because everything is unique. Now here, here's a program, uh, <laughs> a nonprofit organization. What they do is lend you money for 0% interest. How do you like that? 0% interest. Do you think Chase is going to do that? No. And actually only if you have bad credit. <laughs> <laughs> so they anti-bank banks, <laughs> but they're lending money at zero percent. Now here's a neat thing. Now this is the one in. Let me show you uh, this one. This is uh, in the city of Wisconsin, a uh, Madison. That's in Wisconsin. They're also not only lending the money seven five seventy five hundred dollars, but what they do is. Uh, give you a grant, another grant for $7,500. So now you have five fifteen thousand uh, dollars to take your little idea and start your own business. That's what it's for, for individuals to finally start a business that they always want to do. But they're not the only city. I mean, just right, the same thing you know, is going on in another city. Uh, oh, here's the, here's the ones that give you 0% interest. It's called Kiva or Kiva, K I V A dot org. Dot org. You only want to go to dot org or dot gov, okay? Very rarely will you get anybody who has a dot com and not going to rip you off, charge you money or whatever. Dot org and dot com, see, they don't even charge you money. I mean, dot uh, gov, they don't charge you money or they give you the money. You don't have to borrow it, they give it to you. <laughs> and that that's here's another city that's doing that in Baltimore. Oh, no, that's another one. <laughs> uh, um, uh, here's another one and here in Baltimore. What they have is four programs, uh, one, two, three, or five programs just for paying your water bills. See, everybody thinks, well, I called, I had a water bill or utility bill, and, and uh, I called the office and they said they had no money. No, no, you can't do that. You know, you, <laughs> that's only one place. It's like, oh, oh I, I asked somebody out for a date and they said no. So I, I, I guess I can't, I'm not going to get a date, right? No, no, <laughs> you can't do that. Oh, oh I, 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 I called that company to get a job and they said they don't have any. Uh, so I guess there's no jobs. No. <laughs> Grants are like that too, man. Just because you can call one place <laughs> and they don't uh, have money for you. Man, there are other ones. So this one has, there, there's five. You know, they're advertising five and there's two other ones. So that makes seven. You know, just on, <laughs> just for water bills. That's just one. That's not utility bills for uh, electricity and uh, other stuff that you may have. I mean, that's pretty cool, I think. Uh, and they give up the five thousand dollars pay a water bill man five thousand dollars you must be a swimming pool <laughs> I have to pay that for a water bill uh and that's in baltimore so you have to find out what's in your uh place now here's the water bill assistance one of them here and that's where it shows up the five thousand dollars uh and you can't make more than fifty eight fifty three thousand dollars to be eligible for it but if you're worried that you don't have enough money, uh, I mean, you make too much money for a government program to give you a grant, here's a nonprofit organization that that's who we want to help. People who make too much money to get money from a government program, or you didn't qualify uh, for a government program. See, there's other programs. So that's why you're going to call up one program and say, well, uh, no, you make too much money. Uh, you can't have, it. or no, you live over in this zip code or whatever. You can't have this money. See, and what happens is people turn away because they don't know any better. They don't know the system or whatever. And they talk to a government official for a government grant. And the government said no. So they believe them. And that's true. But that's just for them. It's a big it's a wide, wide world out of there. Yeah, out there. And that's what you have to do is stay in there uh, because you won't get anything if you're taking no for an answer because you're in one place. They don't know everything. Everybody can't. They just know what's in front of them. And it's too big for that. So you have to do it. And that's what we do see at Let's Go Help. When you have members helping members, then you say, hey, yeah, I had to do that. You know, and you see somebody and then I finally got $14,000, you know, uh, because of that. See, and that's why I think these members that are helping members are better than I could ever do because they're more like you. They're just starting out and doing this. I've been doing this for 50 years and it's hard to me to relate. <laughs> what would I worry about 50 years ago when I didn't know anything about this stuff, you know? And that's hard and that's why these members, man, are, are doing a better job than I am. So that's $15. Okay, so, uh, okay, so here's the other one for here, Operation 
fuel. <laughs> so they give you money if you don't, you're not eligible for other ones. Uh, here, here's Augusta County has an interesting uh, uh, program uh, for small businesses because the biggest thing in a small business is if you're an individual want to start a business is marketing. Sure, you can spend all the th stuff and equipment and things like that, but you're not in business till you get a customer. <laughs> what the hell is all that stuff for? Nothing. Just to please you or the people, you know, you give money to people... <laughs> <laughs> who sold you all this stuff. But what you really need is customers. And this is a program that gives you $10,000 uh, just for marketing. <laughs> Isn't that great? Uh, and, and that's the kind of help that's out there. Now, if you want to find this kind of stuff where you live, you have to find out where you live. And what do you do is you go to sba.gov and then put after that slash local assistance. And then you'll see, you put it in a zip code there and then you make an appointment with local counselors who help you start a business. They're all free. They help you think through your idea. You don't even have to know how to spell entrepreneur <laughs> and they'll help you uh, start your business, okay? And that's very important uh, that you do that. Uh, so that's sba.gov slash local assistance, okay? Uh, now here's what's interesting going on. We need caregivers, okay? We don't have enough, oh, oh, where is it? No, oh, here's the caregivers, okay. Here's the care, we need caregivers. And so now what uh, company or, or states are doing, like like uh, Pennsylvania, they're saying like, if every caregiver now is gonna get $2, uh, at least to start, to start. It used to be starting at $15 an hour in, in Pennsylvania. Now it's gonna be $17 an hour. So they have to get, create more caregivers. There's so many jobs out there are going unfilled and you don't need a degree or any of this kind of stuff, you're a caregiver, you know? Um, and, and so they're increasing not only the wage to make sure because that's a, a supply and demand. Actually, school teachers like that and everything. We're short of people. So if you wanna get a job, man, this is the best time to get a job. You know, they even train you for free too. And that's it. And some of these programs that train you even have uh, money to give you money to live on while you're training for the couple of weeks, couple of months or whatever it is to train for the job and start making a decent living and, and grow quickly because these are jobs that are in demand, man. Uh, and speaking of another in demand job, I, I can't believe this in a way, commercial pilots, you wanna fly, fly for an airline? <laughs> <laughs> They're dying for people. All the baby boomers are, are retiring and uh, all this stuff. So we have a big shortage of commercial pilots. So you don't need a, a college degree anymore to become a commercial pilot because there's such a, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, an opportunity, so many jobs they're trying to fill out there and there's training programs available to help you do that. Uh, there are also, these jobs started at $100,000. They start with no degree. They start and go up to $200,000. Man, what else are you going to do to start at $100,000 and go to $200,000? Maybe if you have a mask and a gun or something, that's a way to do it. But these are legit jobs. So how do you find out about these things? Okay, you go to careeronestop.org. Careeronestop.org. Uh, to find out about, hey, what kind of training programs for whether it's pilots or anything else. Now, that's just the start. See, if they don't have anything for you, just like everybody else, you don't say, okay, I, uh, no, and, hey, I, there's nothing out there. Yes, there is. You have to keep looking. Another way to start looking is go to findhelp.org. Go there again and put in your zip code, then put in job training. Like where I live, live there's 70 or 80 nonprofit organizations that train people for high skilled jobs for free. No degree, no cash, no nothing, you know, for you to get a decent job. So you spend a couple of weeks or whatever and you start a job at 40 grand that could go up to 100 and something, you know. And that's the important thing, that you get the degree uh, to have the skills that are for jobs that are in the band. Every state is dying to get more people to get this training. Biden gave so much grant money out for people to start new businesses, start new manufacturing, and it's all higher tech stuff that you need some skills to do that and they'll give them to you for free. So that's what you wanna do. You have to go out and bang on those doors and find out how they don't come to you. You have to go to them. The people wanna get your money, come to you. The people wanna give you money, you have to go to them. And that's what we do at lescohelp.com. So let me try to help you too.